Hi everyone, my name is Marius Venter. Uh, this is the short version, the really short version of setting up IRF uh, between two VSR routers. Uh, very quickly, I'm not going to spend a lot of time there, but effectively, if you've seen some of my other videos, you need to assign a network adapter to a LAN segment. In this case, I've called it IRF1. That's router 1. Let's check router 2, settings, and network adapter. It's also connected to IRF1. That's really important. Um, at this point, okay, so I'll go to VSR1, that will be the member one. You'll see that there is no configuration to control D, so system. The first thing we want to do is IRF member one, that's done. IRF dash port. In the IRF port, I'm going to actually say port group interface gigabit ethernet one slash zero. That's the interface assigned to it. You quit out of this one and you say chassis mode or sorry, chassis convert mode IRF. That's going to ask me, are you sure you want to save this information? Yes, save it. And do you want to reboot? Yes, and make it available. That is first one done. Okay, on the second one, let's go into it. Uh, pretty much also no configuration yet. And I say system and like I said, IRF, this one is member two. Uh, IRF dash port. Once I'm in IRF port, I'm going to say port group interface gigabit ethernet one slash zero. Okay, that's done. Quit and we say chassis convert mode uh, IRF. Yes, I want to save it. Okay, and yes, I want to make it available. And it's busy rebooting right now. If I go back to VSR license there, you will see if I do display IRF. At the moment, IRF has been enabled. Okay, all depending how long the reboot takes. And that should be coming up in the next couple of seconds. There it is, starting to come up now. That looks pretty good. Display IRF. And there it is, IRF configured on both of the devices. And that's under three minutes flat. Okay, so just confirm one more thing, display IRF. Right, there it is, everything is good. I'm happy that it's up and running. Good, and that was the under three minute configuration of IRF. Please support us on ABC Networking on the YouTube channel. Please like it. Uh, please make some suggestions if you want to see some configuration files. This was a short version of exactly how to set up IRF on the VSR. Thank you very much.